Hello everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Insurgents with Grover Games. So it's been about two to three weeks since I actually recorded anything with Pokemon Insurgents. I had a lot of real life stuff going on and I got sick there for a while. So hopefully this will probably air a week after I start uploading again. I just kind of want to give a little bit of explanation of what went on. I, I, like I said, I just got busy with a bunch of real life stuff and then I got sick there for quite a few weeks. So... But I'm back now, we're finally recording again, and we went and got ourselves a Tyranitar, and he looks goofy because I went and bought him that Tyranitar armor, so we're going to give him a, give him a try. He's got adamant nature, and I got him all EV trained and such, so he's ready to roll. And I'm going to keep him in the party for now, till after this gym, just because I remember this gym being ghost, dark, or psychic, something like that. So we're gonna go in here today and get chal get challenged in the gym leader. Shh, hiding from the monster creature with the tail of a snake. Nobody can fight it because they don't even know what it looks like. Huh. I still haven't seen this creature yet. I'm guessing it's a night encounter, but we're gonna go in here and get started challenging this gym. Well, hey there, champ. Hey, oh there, champ. Dana here has themed her gym around dreams. That way, she can use her two favorites. Types. Psychics, psychic and ghosts. Dark types are your friend here, for sure. Ghost types, too. Oh, and another thing. There's a lot of trainers here, but they don't give as much experience as you might want. That's because you're supposed to avoid them. Take this for luck. I'll be the judge of that. I mean, how are you supposed to avoid them if... They Bring it on, you don't have a chance. So we're going to use Tyranitar. I replaced Waifu with Tyranitar, so we're going to use him for a while. And I guess I never went through his move sense here. And it's... So I trained him up and then I got sick there, so I can't even remember most of it. So he's got Crunch, Earthquake, and Hone Claws, so... Oh, well, that's... that didn't hurt too bad. <laughs> Yeah, I can see what, I'm, what they mean by not much experience. It's pretty scary in here, isn't it? Not really, lady. A dusk noir. Let's crunch into that. And I, I also got everyone up to level 65. Wow, you can, you can tell it's been a while because I didn't really do the intro like I normally do. So let's see here. I'm going to beat you so badly, I almost feel bad about it. But I think we're going to keep Tyranitar until after this gym, and then we might bring Waifu back. Just because the sand stream he offers is going to be more detrimental to the team that I got going right now. The only person who truly benefits from it would be Bears. But right now, he's going to be... I think he's going to be a really good answer to this gym. Leave it, lady! Wait. A chance was taken, a chance was missed. To not fight trainers and to persist. But a chance you had and had again. To walk straight into her domain. Oh! Huh! So is this literally how? That is... That is actually very clever design, so it's just a... Invisible wall. Welcome to the Gym of Dreams. Where walls are sightless and not as all as it seems. Leave no stone unturned or unexplored. So walk right on here and find just a reward. You know what? But I want the money. I don't care about the XP. I want the money more than anything right now. <clears throat> I mean, two thousand dollars per fight. I can. I'm. I'm fine with fighting these trainers. Plus, it gives us a chance to see what they really got for a Pokemon. I mean, nineteen hundred per trainer. I, I am completely happy with. Our guys. 
I was say, I'm pretty sure there's not a... There's not gonna be a Pokemon that... Tyranitar can't go through, especially... Even though his armor doesn't give him a bonus to anything. That's ba how bad you're gonna get beat. Sorry, I got kinda distracted. Oh, no, 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 no. This is terrifying. We're just gonna hone claws up. Uh, we'll go one more hone claws. <coughs> that would have been the time. There we go. I don't know why I got so paranoid about fighting a Wobbuffet. I guess I'm just thinking back to... Oh, Nuzlocke's. Venus just threw this door. Do you think you could take her on? I mean, I could have taken her on a little while ago, lady. I just... I want your money. I want your lunch money. Not good experience. I mean, it is not... It is not good experience, but you know what? Tyranitar with his boosted experience gain is really getting the most out of it. Can I tell you a secret? I can't actually see the future. I'm only a really big fan of psychic types. Well, at least you're not a phony. I'm gonna say, I don't remember if these have levitate. They do not. That's fine. Rifloom. Ah, uh, let's... There we go. How does it feel to know that you... You could have skipped every trader in here. I just want your... I want your money. I, I am here for the money. Not really the XP right now, just the cold hard cash. Just because I don't know what we might need money for in this game. I might need to get some new duds. Oh, dang it. I think one more. Oh, that, that actually hurt. <coughs> that actually hurt a little. Well, you know what? Let's... Let's bring out Helios. The bug moves will help against the few psychic types if I... Is, it, is that what it's gonna say on the, every other side? The same exact thing? Oh, it's Silverwind. I was gonna say, it was gonna be really awkward if I got the... Got the Omni Boost there and it just snatched it all. I don't know if it would be able to snatch it all. That'd be a fun experiment to find out. Give Helios a chance to shine. Helios. I just want your guys' money. That's all I really want. This heat wave you. So is So is it gonna be the same on every side, like traitors? I feel like it has been so far, but I'm not sure. Oh no! That's fine. We're going to heal after this anyways. I'd do it for the money. I'd say you win, but that'd be ju just a lie now, wouldn't I? I don't know if I read that weird or it just sounded weird. Maybe both. <coughs> uh, we'll get a silver win. Maybe we'll get an Omni boost from it. Nope. Well, I know that you're not gonna live this. But that's fine, I... Sacrifice this had to be made. But we're pretty much done anyways. Let's send in Millie. Really? Millie didn't kill it with Moonblast? Interesting. Alright, so let's get out of here. 
Let's go top off our pokey, pokey friends. And we're definitely going to leave with Tyranitar. I don't even know how to pronounce that name. Begin with either, so I'm not even going to attempt it. Uh, so how much money do we have now? Just we went through all that work. Earned thirty-eight thousand dollars. That ain't too bad. I can't believe we started this on March tenth, and it's already the end of May. But this has been an extremely long game. Plus, I may have grinded a little quite a bit. Hopefully, I didn't overgrind too much here. Alright. Well. My normal save before the gym leader thing. Kind of funny how old habits like that die hard from other games, but let's do this. Welcome, Challenger. I am Dana, leader of the Selene City Gym. I... The, well, the gym I run is themed around, themed around dreams, and as such, I specialize in both psychic and ghost types. I hope you found my gym puzzle clever. If you understood the pwn, I'm sure you had no trouble getting through my gym at all. When it said to walk right ahead, well, I couldn't be any more literal. But anyways, enough of that, right? Let's get this show on the road. Get ready to lose. Bring it. Peter Dana would like the battle. Uh... I don't like this. Yep. That's what I was afraid of. I kind of knew it was going to get will o wisp Especially with the sable eye lead. Erdiver. Well, let's just crunch you. Say, he's... He's not getting a very good gym de debut. But that that's probably my own fault there. Uh let's let's head into Bears. Since I know he's gonna be out outspeed this Gardevoir now with the sandstorm. Chandelure. Oh gosh. No 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 no. Let's just get him out of there. Oh, must have had a white herb. Interesting. Let's... Too weak to substitute. That's fine. Just surf away, Millie. I was waiting. I was honestly waiting for another full restore from her. Gengar. Oh, let's. Oh, Life Orb, Gengar. Interesting. You know, if I was thinking I could probably get... Well, no. He's probably got a fire move. Uh, let's recover here. Oh, what? That's weird looking. And I don't like you... I don't like you setting up. That was a crit? Wait, Anik Legendary? Um... Let's... Let's head into Killian. I wonder if we can get a setup. <laughs> uh, so we're gonna... Let's make it evolve. And let's get the Leech Seed and see if we can maybe get it set up on. Because this Cresselia is starting to set up on us. Which is going to be scary. But I think we can out... I think we can outlast it. At least we should be able to with us setting up as well and getting Leech Seed from Cresselia. I am really glad I never got rid of Leech Seed. Oh, let's Moon Blast her. Get rid of it a little faster. Gosh, Cresselia is tanky. 
I suppose she does have quite a few setups, though. Well, goodbye, Gothitelle. I don't know what your deal was, but apparently you... I remember them saying something about her mega evolution to get it three types, but I don't know what it quite... Quite exactly how that works, but... Gym leader down! That's... That was an okay battle. Tyranitar didn't help as much as I thought he was gonna be, so... He's... It's a good thing we're putting him back in the box for waifu later. It seems as if I've been toppled. I guess it had to happen eventually. Congratulations. Here's your prize. The Dreamland Badge. This will let higher level Pokemon obey you. It can also attract rare or wild Pokemon in certain areas, such as the Friend Safari. I take this too, as a gift from me. Oh sweet, Psychic. TM29 contains move Psychic. Psychic is perhaps the most well-known Psychic type move. It is very strong and very reliable. This TM is definitely an invaluable asset for any trainer. Next, I assume you'll want to go to Ampharite City. My boyfriend, Cathril, runs... Calrith? Calrith, we're going with. Until I change it in the next episode. Runs the gym there. His team specializes around the range, so you might want to prepare for that. Oh, and don't forget, you can exit the gym j just by going straight down. Thanks, lady. Now, let's head on out of here. <laughs> oh. Well, somebody's heading that way. I think it was that... Tan guy, whatever, with the armored Pokemon. Well, first things first. I'm gonna grab Waifu, because I feel like the her ice typing is gonna help. <laughs> I also trained her up as well. <laughs> I don't know. The whole armor thing was interesting. I don't know how much it really benefited us, though. So. Well, let's get out of here. Let's top everyone off. And I think we're heading to the Dragon Ruins next. So let's head out. Let's start heading out that way. Close the sign. Oh, that sign's... Dragon Ruins closed, so that sign's still up. Run away from the angry looking Charizard. Uh, looks like. Yep, looks like we sh Wait. Huh. I thought there was gonna be something else back over this way. So, let's see. There's a full heal there. Nothing that way. Ooh, he's candy. Let's... Wait, can we... Can we walk on those walls? Okay, nope, it's just... The broken effect. I was kind of wondering if they were kind of like a weird staircase. Like an old ward staircase looking thing that we could jump on. But apparently not. Oh. Three dive balls. Neat! Something else. Is that a magnet over there? Looks like a magnet. <coughs> Excuse me. A go lurk. Yep. Got another magnet. Looks like there's something else over behind there. You know, it'd be nice to see something a little bit more interesting. I know there's step tiles over here as well. Unlo for this being a dragon temple, sure haven't seen a whole heck of a lot of dragons. Just saying. Well, that's back. There's something back here. A revive. Well, that's kind of lackluster to me, but okay. Nothing that way. What's in this water? Nothing that interests me either. 
I wonder if we'll find a Delta here. That'd be kind of neat. It's been... I feel like I've been back this way, but I'm not sure. No. Let's see here. Yep, let's surf. TM-50- Oh, Focus Blast! That's not a bad find. Too bad I don't have good luck with moves with low accuracy. Oh, I didn't mean to click there, but hey, a free ether. I'll take it. Waifu is pumped up and raring to go. Max Repel. This is kind of, kind of quite the maze. I didn't think there it was gonna be this kind of maze trying to get back up this way. Three full restores. There is a lot of like, odd items on the ground. Wonder if that's just a legit Pokeball? I'm guessing it is. I don't even know how you would get to- Oh, right there, like Rock Climb or something like that, which we don't have. Oh, look at that, we're here. GG, I'm so glad you decided to show up. This is the moment of my triumph. Every time I failed, you were there to witness it. After we tried to create the perfect Delta Pokemon, after we experimented with Mega Evolution and the incident with Pokerus and Malad. And now, that our experiment with armor failed too, you might think we're running out of ideas. Kind of. Tell me, GG Nora, do you know the myth of the Unova Dragon? Legends speak of a gargantuan dragon that once reigned all over all of Unova. Its power was su supervised by two brothers, the princes of the regions. However, these brothers constantly fought over their beliefs. One seek truth, one strove for ideals. And finding no middle ground, they split the great dragon into three. Reshram, Truth, Sekirub, Ideas emerge, where Kiram was left as the dragon's empty husk. This rune is very, very ancient. While the dragon did rule in Unova, the war between the brothers was in Torin. In fact, the great splitting was at this very spot. A shrine was built here in hopes that one day the dragon might be formed once again and bring peace to the land. That day is today. While Rekru has been busy experimenting, the most important job in the Perfection Cult was left to me. It was difficult. I needed three different legendary Pokemon, but I succeeded. And now, the original dragon was said to be a sign of leadership of wholeness. It represented opposing beliefs, fighting neutral ground and working together. The ideal idea of harmony and of perfection. Once we summon this creature, we'll be unstoppable. The only thing left is to begin. Reshram, Sekram, Kiram. It is time to return to your origins. Join together and become whole once more. Chanting cult stuff here. <laughs> <coughs> and now, Great Dragon Unova, the divine perfect god, emerged the great name here. Name here. Um, what did you say? Maybe you didn't hear me, dragon. I said emerge the great name here. Name? Wait. Are you reading that off a of scroll? <laughs> yeah, why? I'm pretty sure you're reading that wrong. I think you're supposed to say the dragon's name at that part, not just name here. It's probably a placeholder. Oh, huh? That's what the parentheses are for. But hold on. That's impossible. Nobody knows the name of the original dragon. The only names that survived were Reshiram, Zekram, and Kiram. How are we supposed to bring it back then? Fine. I was hoping to restruct the or or original dragon today, but it seems like that's not happening. I'll find that name. I'll search every scroll, text, or book until I learn it. But for now... I'll split you into Kiram White and Sekram. Come forth and serve me. 
The idea. I'll deal with you, t with the two of you here and now. This is the end. <coughs> oh, it's a. D oh. Do I go? Let's go all in. Oh, come on! I'm- I'm not mad I'm disappointed in you, waifu. Your debut- your debut battle and you- You let me down. Let's send out Millie. Let's just moonblast the Salamance. He's more threat. Oh, jeez. I thought Millie would have done more damage to him than that. Okay, good. Is he gonna have just a full team of dragons? I suppose Millie doesn't have that much attack power. Well, let's. Oh! Oh, uh, I guess I shouldn't be surprised, because I do have the Mega ty Typhlosion Stone. Well, bye, Lav Lavani. Oh. That's a little terrifying. He's already level 67? Well, let's just Aqua Tail that. And she's still using Mega Flygon. Jeez! Gosh, this Mega Typhlosion is actually really scary. Thank Lord. Sakuram. Okay. I think this is the perfect time to send bears in. I feel two electric attacks coming. Nope. Well, yeah, I was. There's one, just not towards some bears. Well, Selby. Bears is more important than you. Oh yeah, I knew it. that worked out pretty well. Oh yeah, I forgot that we had Sticky Web on the field. That actually probably helped quite a bit. Uh, it's Iron Head the. There we go. Nice. I think that crit mattered. And let's iron head it for. Oh damn, so it'll be out sped. I was hoping bears would get the final kill. Millie's level 68, and bears got to 66. Not bad. 6,800 bucks. What? Impossible. Don't you know who I am? Kiram, Reshiram, Sekram, what's happening? The ritual wasn't done yet. Get back together. No, Sekram, get back here. Reshiram? I'm so glad you're okay. You're not hurt, are you? You're all fools. This isn't the end of this. I'll bide my time. You better hold on tight to your friend, child. Because once I find that name... You're going to wish that restaurant was only stolen from you. Kiram, let's go. We're leaving. That was scary. I'm glad nobody knows, but I can't help wondering. What was the name of that dragon? Well, I have a theory. It's probably wrong, but Kiram is the shell of the original dragon, right? It's what was left after Reshram and Sekram split from it. And there's the fact that the fusions are called Kiram White and Kiram Black. Well, I don't know if you remember this, but back at the Ultra Library, I was looking at a book on Unova word st structures. There was a page that talked about the legendary trio. Reshram was a prefix, meant truth. Sekram was a prefix that meant ideas. 
Oh, no, no. Rash is the sack, sorry. Nobody really agrees on what Kira means, but most tarantulas just believe that it's whole or complete. I never really questioned how little sense that made. Kirim is the opposite of complete, after all. Tan said the original dragon was perfect, a symbol of different beliefs working together. Maybe more accurate translation of Kira would be perfect. Wow, I never thought of that. Yeah, it's just a theory, though. GG, the Infernal Cult said they were in the mountains, right? We have to go after them. If we strike them before they strike us, maybe we can have a chance. Oh, I nearly forgot. Your mirror can transform into anything it has the DNA of, right? That's how you use Shaman's ability to get around, even though you didn't actually have it. Why don't you take this? It's a hair from Celebi's head. Tesseract ability outside of battle. Okay. To use Tesseract, you need to find glowing areas where space-time is torn. If it's white, you can travel back in time. But if it's red, you can move other objects through time. You're smart. I'm sure you're figuring it out. It's a lot less complicated than it sounds. Just make sure you're close to the rip. Best of luck. Hey, GG. Listen, I owe you one for helping me out and restaurant too. If you need anything like to train or something, just let me know, okay? I'll be glad to give you a hand. Okay, well, I guess this is we're going to end the episode today. Go, go, went a little bit longer for recording, but... But we're going to, like I said, we'll end it here. That was quite the interesting battle. Oh, the team's heal. I thought we were going to have to go heal. But when we come back, we'll start right here. i like to thank everyone for watching. If you enjoyed today's episode, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel. If you're enjoying the content, please subscribe so you can stay up to date to the latest series. Above all else, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day. And most of all, thanks for watching. Yeah.